Definitely not the best opens. How do I unsubscribe from these cat facts? Uh, it works so well. I'm already on day three. King Mob 13, thank you for the tier one sub. Ovion Kenobi, thank you for the 15 month sub. Wow, my black is horrendous. Maybe I splash for Lantern, but yikes. Ooh, God. Oh no, another awful pool. Oh lordy, help. All right, guess I'm building aggro. Do I even have the resources for a five color? Yikes. Big yikes. Chemical 91 month sub, holy smokes. Thank you, friend. Curse scroll, thank you for the 77 mo uh, months of prime. Yeah, why could I, <laughs> why didn't I open four pack mates? They're both common. I do think the red-white aggro deck is gonna be fine. No, blue is not good enough. A little splash for our friend Carter. Anything else black worth splashing? I'm not. I don't think I'm going to splash Lantern. He's weak. I mean, eh, it's actually good enough to splash. All right, what does this do it again? Exile it, return tar another target aura or equipment from your graveyard to your hand. Might run like one of those. Oh, I have no demon bolts? Yikes. God, I don't have any equipment beyond, beyond the helm? Yikes. Oh man, I needed a raven wings real bad. Oof. All right, maybe I have to look back at the green. Or Jasper a Sentinel with at least War Master is kind of cute. I don't know if this is the. I don't know if Aggro is the way to go here. I guess I would cut the Invoke out of the main if I'm doing this. This doesn't actually look that bad. But I think it's a little bit short of being good enough. All right, just <sighs> this is why deck building on arena kind of sucks. Let's see about that. Good splash for like crush the week two. Ooh, this fixing is kind of weak. Mm. Jasper a Sentinel. Okay, this is actually not looking very good. No, it might actually be red white that I need to do. The Sentinel the Sentinels aren't even good in this deck. If I draw exactly the War Master or somehow like ramp out into this turn four, sure. But 
Otherwise, they're just terrible, so. Yeah, I might go. Ha I might have to go piddle, pitiful aggro. The aggro is not going to be terrible, but um, well, it's not my first choice. Also splash for like Kennel Master. It's not a terrible card in this type of deck. I have two Axe Guard Armories? That's not even good. Search your library for an Aura and or Equipment. I only have one Aura. Sorry, I only have one Equipment. Probably run one, but... Two, four, six, twenty-five. Maybe run the Kennel Master here. Well, that's true. But I don't think I'm going to run two. There is a downside to running tap lands. Man, this I needed a I needed a Raven's Wings or a pickaxe. This fixing's kinda sad. This I think it's worth running. Yeah, and then I think we went one and two and then we lost two thousand just immediately. Poof. Best of three sealed is not good for gems. You have to get to three wins to almost break even. So even going two and two once is dramatic. One, two, three, four, five, six. I can probably cut one card, go 16 land. Maybe I just cut the Divine Gambit then. What's up, Snow Does Crash? Thank you for the nine month sub. I mean, I do have a Frostbite, so I guess I do run all the Snow Mountains. How many attempts until I make it? Five, six, seven, one, two, three. Six, seven, eight. Three black sources is a little bit short here. Oh, I guess I have Magda that can potentially make treasure. That would be good. Yeah, the Skull Cairn might not quite be worth it. Not with only two other black sources, 2.5-ish. It's close. I, I normally do like running those type of lands even in this style of deck, but it's... It's probably not quite good enough. So that's 8 red, 7 white, 3 black. It's pretty, pretty even split on what I need early. It's probably fine. Yeah, this is this is one of those pools we are hoping not to open tomorrow. Okay, we have si sideboard shackles, which is fine. We can give this a shot. Oh, do you have to get? Okay, maybe I was wrong.
And I'm just slamming this lantern turn four. Easy. Or am I? They didn't cast anything? I guess I'm just gonna beat him down then. <laughs> oh honey, what are you doing? <laughs> Romenis, thank you for the eight months! New mod I queued early for the open and now the feds are at your door. What do you do now? I can take the blame for you. I did tell you how to do it, so. Oh, I didn't look at their foretell cards. No, Chad, I forgot. <laughs> not again. So bad not checking the foretell there. Put a post-it on your monitor. Foretell, you big dummy! I even have post-its right here. But you think I'm gonna do that? You think I'm gonna take the two seconds to increase my likelihood of winning? Hell no. Hell no. NHN SIG! Thank you for the 42 months of. Ooh, a turn two Magda? Or rather, no, a turn two Story Seeker. Because this is a dwarf. It's just like Morph, yeah. At the end of a game, the opponent has to reveal their Morph cards. What's up, Washtub Scout? Thank you for the 20 month sub. The only reason I would give Magda the plus one plus one counter there is to play around a fight. Untap land next turn is pretty sick if they don't do too much here. I get to go breakneck berserker into another three drop. Ooh, ooh. I have a feeling this wings is gonna blow them out. Dude, Magda is so stupid. I hate it. It's not even like it's a bomb or anything, it's just it's one of those cards that if you play it early, you know, and your opponent doesn't have an answer or vice versa, it just, it's so annoying. Yeah, like, who wants to even play versus this? Stupid Magda. Stupid Magda. It, it's my least favorite card to see on turn two from the opponent. If you don't immediately kill it, you're just like, oh, why am I playing? Yeah, 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 win and complain. But, just, it doesn't, like, it, even if, even if I'm the one playing it, it's still, I hate it. I hate it. How many dwarves do I have in this deck? I have five. Okay. Yeah, and if you have a boat or something, you just tap your Magda, crew the thing. Oh, look, I got treasure.
Wait, have I actually drawn five lands in a row? I kept a three lander, right? Admittedly, it had no red, but... Or, sorry, no white, but I think I've drawn five lands in a row. Alright, game. I hate you. That was pretty brutal. First land draw was good because it was a white source, but my god, I, I think that was actual six lands in a row. Alright, well. This land might not, or this hand might not even mind drawing six lands in a row, but I'm sure I won't even find any. Please land! Face and D, think of the 15 months of Prime. God damn it! Oops! I attacked! Haha! <laughs> Best case scenario, baby. <laughs> <coughs> I think that was the one card, right? It's the one card in the format. Would not be surprised to see some kind of wrath here. I guess it would have to be the uh, minus three, minus three. <coughs> Arne. Oh, that is no, honey, no. Okay. Oh, honey! Oh! Now it makes sense. <coughs> Damn, how many, how many spells did they cast that turn? Like five? <laughs> Felt like it. One, two, three, four? They cast four spells with five mana? Yeah, we're back to dead. They're going to gain an extra 4 life next turn, too. Yeah, it was a very... very weird Wrath. Oh, so close to killing him here. I don't know if they just forgot that I could have crewed, but I should have just blocked anyways. Man, I can't win if I attack, I can't win if I don't attack. Feels pretty gross. Alright, hit a land here please. Thank you. Oh god damn it, excuse me. <coughs> Lean four. <clears throat> oh, I got carrot fragments stuck in my mouth.
<coughs> Ooh, milled three land for me and milled a Linda for them. Wait, wings of the cosmos. What the heck? Oh god. <coughs> oh. <coughs> These damn carrots. Um. I guess maybe I missed one point of damage by not doing this pre-combat, but I wanted to make them scared of a trick. This game is still very winnable, especially with these aggro attacks, damn. Huh. Well, I'm gonna guess they have a removal spell, but... I'm also gonna go for it. happened there, but... <clears throat> oh! <coughs> Carrots are bad for you. Proven here on stream. Oh, God! Fortel! Woo, woo, woo! I'll learn. One day. Won't be today, but one day. Sounds great. If this was a, a a dwarf, I would have played it out on turn one for sure. Oh, right, it specifies tap. You got me. You win. Damn, what a turn! Turn three! What's up? Please don't fight Magda, because I know that's what's going to happen. No touchy. No. Touchy. Hold. Oh my brother. Oh, wait. Oh. oh my gosh. I can rune of speed one of my treasures. Uh. Okay, now I'm kind of scared. I'm gonna do it though. We didn't see a wrath from them, I'm not gonna play around a wrath. <laughs> Could have been a few different things there. Saroff's not like a wrath. Not in that sense. Okay, so. They played unbeatable Linda. I do have a bound in gold I can go tutor for. Oh, oh, God. I was gonna, I was going to baby rage if this red sorcery speed. Oh God, shackles on the Linda now is so insane. Dude, you are a mad lad and I love it. I'm a goddamn 28 life. I guess they're at 20, Never mind. <laughs> I guess they're at 20. <laughs>
I don't really care if they trade for Magda now. She's done her work. That was the best possible one for me. For them to block, I feel like. I used a treasure to equip, but remember I can tap the cavalry and make another treasure immediately. Kinda nice. Nope, I don't need to bind. There you go. I will give your Linda haste. You are welcome. If Linda's their last creature, then we are sitting pretty. They only have one card left in their hand. <clears throat> it makes sense for them to attack now since they know I have the bound in gold. You know what? I don't actually think I cast this. And the reason is, if they have a Broken Wings, I want to make them hold up three mana again. Pretty good too. they do have a broken wings. Yep. So they can block the flyer here. They would go to one life. One damage, oh no, no more than one damage short because I don't have enough. Okay, I mean, if they can find 5 damage... Oh, did I just... No, no, we wanted to play the Sulphurus out because I have the other Snowland so we can 3 damage Frostbite. Yeah, baby! Yeah, baby! What's up, Martin Luther King? Thank you for the 18-month sub. Mr. Izzle! It's whatever you want it to be. Alright, deck. I summon basic planes. Never lucky. <clears throat> Waste of two mana! Waste of two mana, waste of clarion spirit, easy double spell. But it's a goddamn bird and they have two snow lands. Oh, wait, what the? Why does that swamp look weird? Anybody else notice that swamp text? It looks so weird until you hover over it. Do you see that? Oh, Frixian Jumpstart. Just looks very strange to me. Frixian Script. Got it. Carter. What 
Would have been nice to draw planes there for champion plus. These flyers are giving them the biz, but if they just draw like even one removal spell here, here comes a fight, yeah. Alright, so Plains next turn is probably gonna lock it up. That's no Plains. Is there a reason I need to equip one of these? I guess if they have the minus three, minus three. Keep the champion alive. Dead weight or the uh, rare. So I have to assume that's a removal spell. So they're gonna probably kill the Gold Maw Champion prior- Oh No? Okay. So if they had killed the Champion prior, then I don't- um, Oh, is it- No. Yeah, if they, if they don't kill the Champion uh, prior to attacks, I can obviously boast- Double top?! If they do kill it, then I can not attack with the Raider and play the Shield Mate. We're gonna probably get Land Lindwormed. Yep. <clears throat> this is still just lethal though, right? Got him. Oh, thanks. Have a nice day. <laughs> this is still not a pool I want to open tomorrow, but this is what you need to do with, with these type of pools. Smash the people that have better five color decks. Or at least attempt to. Is Dees. Need to find our story circle, or not story circle. Seeker. Story Seeker? What's his face? You know what I'm talking about. Alright, chat. I'm the one with the turn two Magda. You love to see it. No, no touchy! No! Golly! <sighs> what a poopy butt. I have the armory in my hand to go get our helm to put the Rune of Speed on, but this has to be better. Okay, you got me. Oof, now if they have a struggle, we just insta-lose. Well, that's pretty bad too now, isn't it? All it takes, three removal. GG, red white aggro.
No, 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 no. The, uh, not, not the ruined crown. I don't have that. This game is still winnable. Barring Alinda. Humanity! Thank you for the 26 month sub. Damn. Four removal spells, basically? Five, basically? Yeesh. You get me! All right, we just need to fade them drawing, see the natural five color there, and having five removal spells. This matchup actually says, or seems very winnable. Mm. Dun, 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 dun. I need the two drops. <sighs> How greedy is it to pitch a land here, chat? I think my deck needs all of the spells it can. Nice. Oh, was it even a mountain that I bought him to? Oh, no, it was planes. Yeah, I mean... We're still gonna get spa smashed by removal spells. Shock? This would be so much better if I could also... play out my Oracle first. Ugh. This is basically GG already. Jesus! Not again. Not the natural again. When do they get to six mana though? When they get to six, they have just unlocking everything. Remember, when I steal a Spirit of the Elder Guard, it becomes equal to the number of Snowlands that I have. Yeah, it's probably Ripperino Cappuccino. Or whatever, basically, it, well... For me, it'd be lands. We can never win this game. <laughs> They're gaining eight life next turn? Yeah, this, this is more than over.
Rip. GG's. Oh no. Now Rizzle, Rizzle's gonna come in here and spit all over me, stupid streamer. I beat you. Oh, I'm gonna keep this and hope I draw two drop. What's up, BitRot? Thank you for the six months of medium fanness. Humanity, thank you for the 26 months. Please, give me two drop. Two drop. Tip top, two drop. Depends on how many two drops I have in the deck. That kind of counts. Yak, yak, thank you for the nine months. Favorite card in Kaldheim Limited. Uh. Packmate. No, that's not my favorite. Not playing the helm? Nope. I have Clarion Spirit in my deck. Ooh, it might be Svella. Uh-oh, another snow deck. Oh god. Wait, they put that on the pyre? I guess it was their only non-snow. Chat. I told you. This is why we hold on to Tormentor's Helm. Bad news is... Spirit gonna die. Actually, they might call, kill the Goldmaw instead. Yeah, <laughs> this hand is really awkward with only one planes, for sure. That was super awkward that they put it on the uh, Frost Pyre. I mean, it was their only non-snow land, but... Like, now they can't tap it for mana and activate itself. Furthermore, um, if they want to use the ability, they have to sack it. Like... Oh, I do need to keep my creatures protected from it, though, I'm pretty sure. Like, double spelling this turn, I would just lose to them drawing a land to pop the pyre, so I don't think I can actually do that. Their veil's on green. can race here. Pretty aggressive to try to race, even though they do get to ping my 1-1 tokens. Alright, let's go. Whoa! I don't like that! Maybe that was a punt? Oh, sure. Way down. Okay.
Nice. All right. Oh, wait. One, two... No, they can't do it. So, they're gonna... They can't ping... Like, because, again, it's on the Frost Pyre, they can't ping and activate. I don't think so. Flyer's pretty damn good here. We kill them next turn. Because the rune on the helm... The rune on the helm win ne wins next turn. No, you can't do that, OP. Can't tap this for mana and for... They're just dead on board, right? I don't need to show them anything. They were still dead either way, but... They might not have known, or they didn't know that. Oh yeah, what are we calling it now? It's mana value. Mana value instead of converted mana cost. Oh god, I want to greed keep this, but it's not even good with the planes. Not much better. One loss. Seems so daunting. Yeah, but if you look at the payouts... In best of one, you need to get... A, uh, I don't even know how many wins before you even get any number of... Relevant number of gems. Combo. I made a five. Build a five four. We did it, and the opponent's getting mana screwed. Skillful plays added again, ladies and gentlemen. Unlucky for OP. Today is not the day that I want to get free wins. Tomorrow is the day I want to get free wins. Today I want to have good games. Sunday is also the day I would like to get free wins. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, if I just go turn two, Story Seeker, turn three, Magda, attack, play another spell, well, you know, then maybe we got something going. Like, these are the hands that look fine. But then the opponent plays a 3-3, and you're like, ah, crap, not again. 
And then they play a, a, anything with four toughness, and you're like, ah, crap, not again. Alright. Well, it looks like we might be on the mirror match. Like that card. If we had this card, that would increase our deck power by so much. Just because that card can win on its own. Ooh, are they going to use a bound in gold on my shield mate? That'd be kind of nice. Alright. Well, we got a mirror match here. We want to make the Firewalker a 4-3. Pumping up the shield mate doesn't do anything. Pumping up the cleric doesn't really do anything. We could have made the boat a 4-4, but that really doesn't do anything. Okay. Blood has been spilled. No, a 5-4! Black Source? Shouldn't have played my land. I should have attacked with Firewalker and activated. I guess I can go ahead and tutor here instead. That's fine. Pally Man getting the timeout. Got him. I think you need a break. Okay, that's pretty good. Yikes. That's, they have four Berserkers? Damn it. Alright, well we can bound and gold the Hoggy Mob, at least. Eh, I mean, we're doing fine here. They don't really have any good attacks except for the 1-1-2 one, one, Flyer, currently. We're gonna have a problem if they draw their own Warhorn Blast or something, but... All things considered, the board is pretty stable. Yeah, I mean, this is not even be gonna be good that good. They have too much life to work with, for one. If the board continues to stall out, sure, it will be fine, but... So I think we're going to give the Helm to the Cavalry, make it 3 Toughness. Or we could also put it on the Cleric so that it could easily just trade with the Ravager. I guess I already have a 3 Toughness creature in the form of the uh, Longboat. This is indeed sealed, yeah. That's fine. Alright, not a bad hit. I'm guessing they probably have a bolt in their hand. Or some kind of removal spell, anyway. Maybe not. Alright. This is a slightly aggressive attack. But again, things are still pretty stable. Alright, that's not too surprising. Okay, maybe that was the removal they had in their hand. That's not surprising. It's a little bit annoying, though. 
Doesn't really make any of their ground attacks all that impressive, but the raptor starts beating in twice as fast. Probably suit up my Firewalker and attack with it next turn. Uh, four ish? What? Valkyrie's bounding. Cold. If they, had, if they had the Frostbite, they would have killed it already when I played it. Unless they just drew it for the turn. I don't want to show them what I hit beforehand. game. I'm going to I'm going to send in the cleric this turn cuz it has vigilance and the uh, shield mate soon. Oh, that's not bad. No, I only have one black source, so I cannot do it three times a turn. Plus two life here is actually nice, real nice. Mamobe or Mamobe. Thank you for that tier one sub for three months in advance. Thanks, friend. Very kind. We're actually whittling down their random creatures, too. Ah! <laughs> uh, that's funny. Oh no! That's a problem. How many ways do I have to kill that? I don't... <laughs> we used our bound in gold already. I don't know if we have any. Alright. It's a little bit too aggressive to attack with more than that. And Rizzle's gifting five subs to the channel! Thank you, friend! Blue longboat with Valkyrie, that is not a legal play. We've changed it up for the last 80 months. It's M. Rizzle, it's Mr. Izzle. 
Just depends on the time of day what it is. Bleh. In fact, I don't even remember which is the real way to do it anymore. Draft better than you the 21 month sub. I guess I don't want double shackle, but it's nice to kill some equipment with it. You're missing that it is not a legal play to do that still. You can't crew creatures, or rather creatures can't crew if they're bound in gold. <laughs> I think if I go to a game three, I'm going to sideboard into a new deck. I didn't have enough time there, but I think I'm going to go green, blue, splashing black. Do I have an alternate list saved? You can't save it on Magic Arena. Uh, I'm actually not sure. Are you able to save a deck list on Magic Online imported onto Arena? through the sealed deck builder. I don't even think you can do that. Let's go, baby! Groan check. Groan test! Groan test! Groan test! Ooh, 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 ooh. Groan test! We're still just gonna lose. <laughs> Turn three lantern is pretty funny though. It's a juicy divine target. I don't want to invoke right now, even though they can sack. Wow, they keep taking three. What a mad lad Chad. Now next turn, I'm going to invoke the Raven's Wings, make them lose two permanents. Hi, pipe, pipe, train! I mean, this is... I, usually I draft a lot more. This is the most sealed I've done of a new set in a long time. dead. Well, that game went a little bit better than the first one.
just very unlucky seeing a one lander, I guess. All right. That's about as good as five drop is or five card hand as I'm gonna see though. All I need to do is draw a red source and crush the weak. It's that easy. We've got all the colors now, right? Oh, that's good for us. I'm glad they haven't had another creature. There we go. The problem is they have wings of the cosmos in their hand. So I need to leave back the pack mate here to double block if they have a six land. Not even greet it. If we know they have wings of the cosmos, this blows them out. It gives the creature flying. Ah, that's too bad. Mamma mia. Needed to draw a land there so I could play and hold up wings. I don't think so. I can't beat a 5 4. I don't think it's Runamuck. I think it's Cosmos. I'm pretty sure it is. I don't have any way to gain life, do I? I'm not going to be able to beat Runamuck here anyways. <clears throat> Nor can I beat another Demon Bolt or whatever they have. Dang it. I'm pretty sure they had wing Wings of the Cosmos in their deck, or in their hand too. But we'll never know. We'll never know. So my other option, instead of broken winging, was playing out the 2-4 a turn earlier. I don't know. 
Again, I'm not mad that we got three wins with that deck. That pool was pretty heinous, so... Happy to get three there.